Where is she? Um, I don't know, but she was really upset. And what was her name? Sorry, I didn't catch it. TK, do you know anything about this woman? Um, maybe she was a visitor. You said she was a patient. Yeah, I know, but look, if she makes a complaint, maybe we'll find out. You take it. If you don't mind. Sure. David. I need to destroy her laptop and every backup of its contents. What? You've been compromised. Do it now. Rebecca, sorry, I'm, I was looking for tissues. Give it to me. This? Get out of my office. But tissues. Pack your things, Monique, you are fired. Get out! to see me. Is everything all right? Why wouldn't it be? No reason. How can I help? I had a very interesting session today with Drew. Have you got the recording? I do. Maybe just hold on to it for now. I, I think it's better for both of us that way. Oh, I, I suppose you're right. And if anyone asks any questions, you will deny categorically. Has there been a problem? No, no, nothing to worry about. Your career is quite safe. Now, tell me, what is this information that you've learnt about Drew? We're all set. My contact from the northern Arizona's way. So we can expect something online tomorrow? Well, even sooner. They're really keen to talk to us. They can smell a good story. OK, I'll prepare a statement for the Ministry, and then you'll let me have the evidence as soon as you have it in hand. Well, we're just waiting on Monique. Hopefully she'll have everything we need by now. What's this? An impromptu meeting of former CEOs. <laughs> no, we were just making plans for golf. Ah, oh, of course you were. Before you go, does anyone have a recommendation for a PA? I've just lost mine. What's happened to Monique? You know, I really don't know. I thought she was wonderful, hardworking, reliable, amusing. And then I caught her trying to steal my laptop right out of my bag. Really? I know, I'm still trying to get my head around it. It just goes to show, though, you never know who you can trust, do you? See ya. Hi. How was your day? Hard to get my head around. Everything OK? Uh, Cassie's still ignoring my texts. Oh, that's tough. But hang in there. And I have something that might put a smile on your face. Oh? I'm going to petition the nursing council and see if we can get you back looking after patients. That's great. A fabulous nurse getting back to what she does best. I think we should celebrate. Go out somewhere decadent. I'm not sure I'm quite up for that. Well, we'll hang here then. In our love nest. That's your strategy, isn't it? Love people into submission. <laughs> I suppose so. Is it working? It has been. Just not right now? Nicole upset you today, didn't she? She still loves me. And do you still love her? I don't know. Maybe. I do. She got inside your head? Not maliciously. That's not Nick. Are you sure about that? How well do you really know her? She's a good person. I know that. She doesn't lie or try to coerce me. Well, I am sorry to burst your bubble, Maeve, but she has been lying to you for a very long time. About what? Nicole and Drew. They were together for much longer than anyone ever thought. Since before the fires, before Harper left. No. It happened last year at Labour Weekend at a conference in Christchurch. They cheated months ago, Maeve. I know that you loved her, but Nicole is the last person you should trust. I'm so sorry. You're really doing this. Right to my face like butter wouldn't melt. 
Doing what? The track was set and you walked right in. 